PayPal accounts in Nigeria. Do people still use PayPal to receive and send payments in Nigeria and other restricted countries? The answer is yes. I know that millions of people working legitimately online in Nigeria and also the nationals of other countries are struggling in using PayPal, especially if it is what's restricted in their country. But some other people like myself have been enjoying PayPal, millions of other people have been enjoying PayPal, yes, and they've been using this for sending and receiving payments without any problem. And the only difference between those who use PayPal and those who don't is what quality information. There is something that those that are using it know that you that is struggling don't know. Now, on a weekly basis, most times I get message requests like this. You can see my WhatsApp and uh, I'm refreshing. You can see that this is not a screenshot. Okay. I get a message like this and you can see it. Good afternoon, boss. Happy Sunday. Please, do you assist someone to make payments on gig in Fiverr? Okay. Using PayPal. So basically, this person wants to make payments on Fiverr and couldn't just do it because for whatever reason, it involves PayPal. And usually, I do charge a fee to do this. Okay. And uh, now I've thought to myself, I, I, I thought to myself, instead of charging a fee each time I render this service, why don't I just organize an online training where I can teach you how you can process between $2,000 to $4,000 of payments using PayPal every single day. Okay. And you can do this right from your room, right from your mobile phone or your computer screen. Now, before we start, there are four major things I'll need you to know before this can work for you. And the first one is what you will need a valid means of identification, an international passport, driver's license, or the, or the plastic national identity card. Now, amongst them all, international passport is ranked number one. So if you have international passport, that would be a great way. That would be a great way to start. If you have a driver's license too, fine, but international passport is always the number one. Now, secondly, you will need to use a fresh phone number. A phone number, it can be Nigerian phone number, US phone number, or UK phone number. If you don't know how to get USA or, or UK phone number, don't worry, I'm going to show you how to get that. Okay. Now, if you've been banned on PayPal, or if you signed up on PayPal before, any phone number you've used before, any email you've used before, do not try and use that again. You have to get a fresh phone number and a fresh email too. So that is the second thing. Now, the third one is this, and this is the new update right now in your printing PayPal accounts. You have to separate your sending account from your receiving account. Now, you basically have two accounts, sending and for receiving. Now, the whole concept is this, to limit the activity on each PayPal account so that you do not overdo or overuse PayPal. The lesser your activity in each of them, the lesser check or the, le or the lesser eye you are attracting to your PayPal account. So then the fourth thing and the final thing is that this is not a free training. This is going to cost you a little amount of money and you can basically learn it, learn how to open both accounts and you can keep enjoying this just like I've been doing. Now enough of the talks, let me jump onto my computer screen and show you one of my PayPal accounts so you can understand better what I've been saying. So this is one of my PayPal accounts and let's quickly go to my activities, okay, and I scroll down to choose a date range, okay. Yes, let me go way back to a couple of years back, okay. Yeah, let's just go a couple of years back. Okay, let's say from August 2021, okay? And let's let it refresh. Okay, so real fast, let's scroll down. You will see, first of all, this is the, the payment I showed you guys for the guy, the Fiverr guy that wanted me to make payment for him. So I like doing everything live and direct. This is the guy. I helped him process that payment. Now you can see others that I did. You can see... $20, $50, $90, $3, you can see $240, $150, okay? Now, we keep scrolling down, see AfroTunes, some other things that I'm, I'm, I'm making payments for and then processing, okay? Now, let's keep scrolling. Now, I need to tell you something. Some of these transactions were transactions I made, I, I sold to people. They needed PayPal, $100, then I... 
I checked the rates. Then I told them this is my rate, adding about five naira to like twenty naira on uh, each dollar. Okay, and then I made my profits. Sometimes I give them like, the same rate I got my PayPal, and then add an extra a one time fee. So it all depends. Okay, now some of these things also we are arbitrage opportunities. What do I mean by that? I saw a place where I could sell higher. I checked the buying rates. Okay, and then I saw a place I could sell higher. Then I bought and then transferred to that place to make my profits. Also note that what I'm teaching you today is not just arbitrage. Okay, don't just think I'm teaching you arbitrage. PayPal arbitrage. No, it is a way for you to send and receive payment. Arbitrage opportunities come and go. So if you find any, uh, uh, any opportunity for you to make profit via arbitrage and you see a place you can actually buy PayPal less and sell higher, then that is kudos to you. Okay. So you can still see my activities all this while. You can see. You can see they are not stopping yet. You can see. You can see. They are still going. They are still going. These are not screenshots. They are rolling. You can see. You can see. So, and this belongs to me. This is my PayPal account, okay? So, I am basically teaching you how you can operate this, okay? And you can use it to either sell to people, make your own payments, process your own payments if you need to make any payment with PayPal without any issues. Or you can still find an arbitrage opportunity in case if you see PayPal arbitrage opportunity in any place on the internet. Thank you so much for watching till this point. Thank you so much for watching till the end. I really appreciate it. If you enjoyed this one, do give me a thumbs up. If you did not smash this like two times, so you'll be sure and tell me why in the comment section. And also note that the training is going to cost less than $30, okay, less than $30 and you will learn everything that I know about PayPal, about operating a PayPal account in Nigeria, okay, and the other African countries too. Now, if you follow the rules I'm going to give you, the risk of getting banned is very minimal, very, very small. Also note that this is a legitimate way of doing stuff and i'm not encouraging any kind of fraudulent activity if you use your paypal account for any fraudulent activity no matter how you follow the rules and you just use it for fraudulent activity you are going to get blocked and banned by paypal so don't even think of going there okay and just like i said in the beginning of this video you are going to need a valid means of identification to do this a valid international passport or driver's license or the plastic national identity card okay then when it comes to rates i need to say this when it comes to rates we are buying at the black market rate i know some people come and say uh, how can i buy, buy paypal at 600 naira to one dollar when you see that when you already see that the, the the dollar the rate of naira to dollar right now is about 1600 we are getting at the black market rate but you're not having any limitations and you can send as much as you can okay usually between two thousand to four thousand dollars in a day okay if you keep it within that limit you are not going to have any issues at all so if you're interested in this training you can just hit me up on instagram or tiktok this my instagram and tiktok accounts are displayed on the screen right now so you can just hit me up on instagram or tiktok at waterfred one so just send me a dm make sure you have your identity document ready and also your payment because this is not a free training guys okay so thank you once more for watching stay tuned and i'll see you in my next video